Hey guys, okay, so I just finished my makeup live. Yay, love this look. Oh my gosh, so I'm going to now go and do my hair. I'm going to use the Loudmouth um, Curling Iron, 25 millimeter. Just gonna, so I can see my hair. All right, so I've already put in the third wheel, which is an amazing heat protectant. You guys need to legit have this, okay? Um, I think I might put this, yeah, let's put it on now. All right, this is called Airhead. It is a spray and texture, um, it's a texture spray. So, just doing that quickly. All right, I've got lots and lots of body in my hair right now because a little bit of dry shampoo. Let me go and, oops, share this live in other places first. All right, let's see. Share to my page, done. Share to my profile. Uh, share now public, done. Make sure you guys also share my videos. That would really mean a lot to me. Um, just because, like I said, growing my audience is, well, it's a big goal for me, for sure. So I just went in with dry shampoo. Um, it's a really big goal for me, like just to basically, you know, get more followers and all that fun stuff. And then follow me on Instagram. And I am doing some TikTok videos too. All right, I'm gonna separate my hair here. Maybe I'll have to bring you guys closer. I'm getting some glare there but I shouldn't. Okay, you need yourself a comb like this. And let's see, I'm gonna section off about this much hair. Now I have fine hair um, and I don't think I actually did get to use it. I've got it set to 3.30 today. So you clamp it in and then as you're kind of lightly churning it, you're also, um, you're, you lightly have the clamp a little bit open as you do your churn. And then opening up your clamp again, trying not to burn your ear like I just did. <laughs> See, I'm so used to using wands now that I'm like completely having to retrain myself, okay? And it's, the struggle's real. So, when I'm doing my left side, I have my clamp out, all right? And lightly bringing it around. Like I said, by lightly, I meaning I have my clamp open just a little bit. And I'm just gonna go and do some of these layers here. So I'm trying to find the perfect temperature for this, um, which is just requires playing around. But I did my daughter's hair yesterday and it was so gorgeous. Now she has longer hair than I do, but normally I don't have this much grit. Do you see that little bit of pink in there? It's so cute. Uh, but next time I wash my hair, I think I might put some more pink in. So I like to go the same direction when it comes to this. Maybe on the top pieces, I'll switch it around a little bit. And I just hold it for about 10 seconds. Hey, Kaylee! That's right, my top fan. <laughs> okay, so you hold it for about 10 seconds. I don't have it very high, so you shouldn't have to worry about it burning or anything like that. You should never have to use your heat setting at like 450. If it has to be 450, then you gotta figure out something else because that's, that's just too hot, right? All right, so separate this. I'm just feeling back here. Trying to get in some pieces here, but not too big of pieces. So my hair is about shoulder length now. It's grown a lot over Corona. So I mean, that's good, right? And again, about 10 seconds. If you have any questions, feel free to ask while I'm doing it. Okay, I'd love to help you out. Um, so some tips that I have would be always, always, always comb out your hair before you go and put a hot tool on there, like whatever hot tool. Make sure your hair is combed, okay? Not just brushed as in you did it before 
you started, no, like comb your hair, each section. Um, let's see, number two is depending on the tool, you can have bigger sections or smaller sections. Um, when it comes to the one upper, you can actually have really big sections and it works great, okay? Number three, when you're doing curls like this, don't touch them until they're cool, okay? So don't comb them out or play around with them until they are cool. If you do it too early, you will lose a lot of that curl. So again, unless you're looking for that look. All right, now, see now I have to readjust, get myself used to it. Uh, now, when I'm going on my right side, I'm gonna have my clip facing towards me, okay? And just grabbing that. So yeah, um, there's a few tools I'm looking forward to ordering from Head Candy. And I really want that C or the Stay Salty uh, shampoo and conditioner. It looks amazing. Like if you have any kind of like hair issues whatsoever, but it's also like for me, you should be using a clarifying shampoo. You don't have to use it every day because you actually shouldn't be using it every day but you should be using a clarifying shampoo and that's what that Stay Salty is. So if you're on here, say hi, tell me what you're up to today. I am doing a photo shoot today, apparently. But like I said in my other video, I've had a lot of people say they'll go and take my picture and then you're supposed to meet and then it's like, oh, I had this happen or I had that happen. So, I don't know, I'm not gonna hold my breath. <laughs> but I'll look good holding my breath. <laughs> All right, so like I said, I'm not gonna touch any of my curls until my hair is completely cooled. And then we can go and piece apart what we want to. So I am doing somewhat big sections, but I also have fine hair. But it's really, really gritty right now, which is awesome for doing this kind of a look because I'm sure my curls are going to stay. It's going to be awesome. Uh, yeah. So this is also an infrared. You can see it right there. Infrared. And it's so much fun. I love it. All right. There we go. And separate these two sections. Again, combing through. The reason why it's so important to comb through is that when you're putting on heat, you do not want any kind of tangles in there because that's what's going to break your hair, okay? And you don't want to break your hair. Um, and it's really important to go and clamp your hair the right way, and that way you don't get those funky clamp clips. And then if you are still getting them but you're clamping it right, it could be that your tool is too hot. Okay, so I'm going to be also playing around. I wanted to more do it on my daughter's hair first, just because she has longer hair and it's easier to do other people's hair sometimes. Um, on ways to do more of a beach wave with a curling iron. Okay, because I can do it with a hair strainer, no problem, which, you know, again, a year ago I wasn't able to, but now it's like, oh my gosh, I can totally do that. It's awesome. So this top piece is plastic, so you can grab onto it, which is, you know, amazing. So don't worry, we're not keeping with the ringtails here, or the ringlets, okay? Don't worry. All right, let's go section off some hair here. I'm gonna do, I think the back portion maybe? Or can I let it all go? No, we'll just do the back portion right now. So separate it with my finger, that's the back. Clip up my front. I did my nails last night and I didn't use the gel moments yet, but this other brand that I use, not so good. Not so good. All right, oh, this hair is so gritty right now. Oh my God. These curls are gonna be fantastic. All right, because everybody knows how hard it is to go in style clean hair. And that's what ended up happening a lot of the times that I end up using this. So you really want to go and have 
dirty hair. Which is awesome because then we don't have to clean it as often. Yay! Okay. Loosening up my clip a little bit. Don't worry. Grab some hair here. All right. There we go. And. <laughs> Lord. I'm watching Golden Girls. I love this show. I usually watch it falling asleep. So. Uh, on Netflix, I'm in Canada, so I don't get certain shows that you guys get in the States, but one of the shows is love that you guys have in the States and we don't get it here, which sucks. But let me know if you watch it. I've watched a lot of TikToks about it, like blind reactions. And it's like, am I seeing what I'm seeing there? And I'm like, oh man, I want to. Okay. Let's go next section. You just kind of have to feel around and that's what else helps when you have dirty hair is it's easier to go and grab all right so um i finished watching good girls has anybody watched that i really like that show i remember it was on tv ouch misjudge where that was and um I watched it, but then, you know when shows go on like different times all the time? Even if you have a PVR, and sometimes you have no idea when that show is going to come on, and then it's like months, and then if you have any issues with PVR, and then you have no idea what time that show is really on anymore, and then if you end up getting a new PVR like we had to, you lose all your recordings and your set recordings, and it's just frustrating. You end up losing... A lot of the shows so anyways that's kind of what happened with good girls but Netflix has it and I have been enjoying it immensely and I'm done until filming can commence again so now I decided to go and give it a try of uh, Sons of Anarchy so originally Netflix in Canada just had the first season I don't know how many seasons there are, but there's more than one. And I'm like, no, I want more than one season to watch. I'm not going to start watching a show if it just has one season, right? So they decided to bring on more seasons, which is awesome. And so I just started that. I think I'm on the, actually, I think I'm still on the pilot. <laughs> um, but I just started it this morning. So, but I don't like to watch shows like that when I'm doing live videos because number one you never know what it's going to say um that's happened to me before and i'm like whoa <laughs> and uh also because i haven't seen it before i need to be able to pay attention right so here we go we're almost done now look at how fast this was and then so i went from curls to straight with the one upper so i got curls with my diffuser and mousse and hairspray. I had that for three days. Then I went and straightened my hair. And now I'm curling again, but this time with the loud mouth. So I straightened it with the one upper. And yeah, it's pretty awesome. All right, there we go. Last little bit on this side. Um, yeah. So, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, I can't help but look at my makeup. It is so on point. I cannot wait to show you guys the finished look. Because I'm telling you, these Facebook Live videos do not do it justice at all. Okay, like at all. I did an Instagram Live yesterday of doing my makeup. Um, and that video was much more clear and doesn't have like the weird, I don't know if anybody else on here does live videos. But it really, like, it's not the same. Oh, oops, kind of missed a hair. All right, there we go. Um, it's just not really the same. So it looks so much better when I do, like, a pre-recorded video. But I like having you guys on here. I like it if you guys want to ask questions or anything like that at all. But, yeah. So we'll figure it out. All right. There we go. done we've got two more pieces that'll be it all right so let's go this way 
And as I said, always, always, always brush your hair. So important. There we go. That's funny. All right, so once this is all dry, I will separate my curls a little bit and put on some hairspray and I think I'm gonna be kind of done. So yeah, look at how easy this hairdo is. Okay, you just slightly open it up. Okay, oh, I touched it. I shouldn't have touched it, but it's okay. There we go. <laughs> And here we go. Done. Almost done. Yeah. So, yes. Um, so, yeah, pictures tonight. Super excited. Going to meet at like six. Trying to find like a graffiti wall or something. I just think that would be a really fun backdrop to have. Let go of your hair. All right, so now this side should be a bit looser and I'm just lightly combing through, okay? And there we go. There we go. See? And look at that. Oh, fun, 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 fun. All right, now let's see. Do we wanna go put some of it up? I don't know. Let's see, play with our part? No, I might put some of it up though. Could do that with a bobby pin. What do you guys think? Ooh, I like that look. I like this look. All right, so let's go grab a little bit here. Or should we save that for tonight? Maybe right now we'll let it be, okay? And let's go do the part. All right. Done, I like it. What do you guys think? It looks so cute. Okay, we'll turn this off. Okay, put it in I this metal rolling cart that I really like. Okay, so let's put in a little bit of Drama Queen here, just right on the back. Oh, I have the lid on, ready? Okay. Here we go. And right here, I'm just gonna add just a little bit of body to the front. Ooh, I'm liking these curls. And they're all over the place too, which I like. Like I don't want it to look too, you know, perfect. I want it to be kind of like that messy-ish kind of craziness that I have going on. All right, next up, hairspray. And this hairspray does not stink, which is crazy when you think about it, but it legit does not stink. It is amazing. Okay, there is the hairdo. We are done. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, please ask me, okay? I love all of it, so go ahead, ask me anything. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.